the most successful businessman on earth. He started a company with 12 employees. Today, he has the oldest company in history. It's still going on. He has the largest company in history, almost 2 billion employees. And the secret to his success in business was this. He kept on saying, I can do nothing of myself. I can only do what the manufacturer tells me to do. Hallelujah. Blessed is he who comes in the... I can't hear you. Come on, clap your hands, somebody. I say clap. His secret to successful business was never claiming ownership of his life. He kept reminding you and himself that he belonged to the manufacturer. God put his image on you so he could be responsible for you. God put his name on you so he could be responsible for your success. Coming back to God and submitting to God is the most important thing a human can do. Because when you come back to God, you put the responsibility of your success in the hands of the manufacturer. Today, you have just lost your ownership. Now you belong to him. Success is guaranteed. Oh, come on, shout and give him praise. God has to bless you now. <laughs> oh, come on, somebody. Some of you, like the children of Israel, have lost your way. Gone into Egypt. But God cannot forget the product that he put his name on. No matter where you are, he will never leave you there. Because his reputation is on the line. He's going to bring you out to save his name. Get ready to come out of Egypt because he will succeed. The reason why he wants you to depend on him, not because you are weak, but because he wants to show himself strong on your behalf. You are going to succeed to protect his name. You are going to succeed to protect his reputation. Your business is no longer a matter of the economy. <laughs> Your business no longer depends on the Nigerian government or the Zambian government or the Lebanese government or Liberian government. Today, God has taken over your business success. Today, God has taken responsibility for your success. For his name's sake. Say it. For his name's sake. One more time. For his name. That is why God has to heal you today. Why? For his let me close by telling you, just a reminder, it is important for you to brag about the company. <laughs> it's important for you to tell the whole world who your manufacturer is. It's important for you to tell everybody you meet when you leave this mountain, guess who made me? Guess who made me? Guess who made me? You know who made me? Guess who made me? Keep talking about him. Why? Put pressure on him. When you testify about his name, you put pressure on him to make you succeed in the presence of your enemies.
That's why it's important to make announcements about your success and your future. When you get your vision clear, talk about it. When you declare your future, you put pressure on God for its success. If you are quiet about your dream, God is not pressured to bring it to pass. But if you tell the world what God showed you and what God told you, then you have made him responsible for your success. Today, you are going to become a declarer of your vision. Today, you're going to tell everybody from now on what you are going to do before you die. Today, you are going to declare the great work you will do in the name of God. This is the future success of your business. Hi, thank you so much for watching. Please remember you can support our work on our Patreon page and you get access to exclusive content and full videos. And please hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so and click the notification bell to be the first to receive newer content. Please don't forget to like and share this video with your friends to be a blessing to them. Thank you.